Hi friends, how are you? I am Muhammad Leon from Leon Speedy. Welcome to Leon Speedy. In PowerPoint presentation, when you open your file, the file opens in edit mode. But you can save your presentation slide as a separate slide for mode. That means from next time, when you open the file, the file will open in slide show mode directly. Okay. So in this video, I will show you how to save your presentation slide as a slide show, as a separate slide show as a matter of fact. Okay, so without any further ado, let's get started. Okay, this is my PowerPoint slide that I have created previously. So I'm just double clicking to open the presentation. Okay, so this is the presentation slide. Now, if I want to start the slideshow, then what I'll do, I'll just click on this slideshow icon. And eventually slideshow has been started. If I click on mouse, then transition will be started. Okay, like this. Like this. Okay, I'm clicking on escape for exiting. Okay, so for creating a separate slideshow file, just go to record. From here, save as show. I'll save this separate slideshow at desktop. You have to give a file name here. I'm giving separate slideshow. Then just click on save. See, separate slideshow has been finished. So I am minimizing this file. This is the separate slideshow file that has been created right now. Okay. If I click on this file, it will be opened in a slideshow mode, not in edit mode. I'm double clicking. Okay. See, the file has been opened in slideshow mode. So if I click on mouse, then transition will be started like this, like this. So hopefully this feature is very handy. Okay, now for closing this file from your keyboard, just click on escape and file will be closed. Okay, so I'm going back to my slideshow and that is in edit mode. Okay, so this is how you can create a separate slideshow in Microsoft PowerPoint. Uh, if your presentation slide is almost ready and no editing is needed, then you can save your presentation as a separate slideshow. So yeah, that's it. Okay, if you have any query, just comment in the comment section. I will reply. You can follow me on Facebook and Instagram. The link is given in the description box. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you do, give a huge thumbs up. Share this content with your community. Thanks for watching. See you in the very next tutorial. Till then, take care.